Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rat here from Ratko Tarot and this is going to be daily tarot reading <clears throat> general one for the collective June 12th 2018 so this is going to be a four card spread and uh, <clears throat> the first card is showing up the topic of the day over here the second card is it is expressing uh, up the uh, negative approach that we could uh, do or rather this card represents things we should restrain ourselves from doing the next card does represents um, <clears throat> the positive approach toward the situation or the things we should be prone doing and then we do have the fourth card which uh, represents <clears throat> the long-term uh, positive effect in case we do keep these couple of conditions in check so let's see now about the uh, situation of the day and that will be the Tree of Pentacles. So the Tree of Pentacles is associated with cooperation, um, <clears throat> support through someone's development, and that very well could be your development. So that means that you will be supported by um, either, you know, your intimate partners, family, friends, also um, co-workers or bosses. It does depend on your personal situation. But in, in general, the card is very positive for laying down prerequisites or foundations and making preparations for an, an important tasks and project moving on forward. That being said, that particular day, it, it will be very potent for us to slow down the motion for a while and, and attend to those minor details which may uh, <clears throat> further in the future grow into a serious issues and that card it itself it gives us a uh, understanding that right now the situation is in a, such a shape that we actually can manage everything in it and in case we do have something bothering us either into our career or either into our relationship <clears throat> we have to speak about it and attend to it and as I said speak about it it will be very important to be uh, honest and uh, cutting with our words and, and truthful because truth is only one and as it is only one truth there is only one way to, way to say it and that is the straight way without any vague explanations <clears throat> it is because the three of pentacles is also a card associated with um, criticism a productive criticism which means that whatever you dislike into your career today or into your relationship either way the solution can be found all right so the next card shows how we should not approach the day itself and that is the two of cups and that speaks for shyness in a negative position all right so it is uh, as i said here that we may not like everything that has happened around us you know or the minor details we may be shy raising our voice about it you know or we may try to make uh, some <clears throat> excuses not to attend to those uh, yet infant problems but in the same time they can grow up into a serious issues moving on forward into the future that being said the two of cups represents um our um how can I place it? Our radiance, all right? So we need to radiate forward and to show ourselves in front of the world that we are ready to actually uh, do whatever it's necessary, you know, and not and that we, we are not going to leave the things to resolve on their own accord because it's not going to happen, all right? So first things we need to do is to make contact, not to be shy, and also it will be very potent here if we don't uh, celebrate way too early our success success in the sense that right now in case we do have more complex plans this card in a negative position says that it will be not very beneficial if we share the uh, <clears throat> the entire plan with everybody but we need to share only those things that we have to so we can receive that support through development and then the next card it is the things we should be prone doing during that day this is the ten of cups and the ten of cups in that particular case comes as a card showing that we need to request ask and aim for more in any case the card says that right now into our situation uh, we have probably reached the maximum out of our standpoint 
Alright, so we need to make another step moving on forward. For most of us, it's going to be uh, involving moving toward an uncomfortable zone, you know, because it's going to be a new zone. But the Ten of Cups into a action position, because this is an action position, it does speak that the emotional fulfillment that we are seeking through our standpoint and our and our current efforts is maximized. All right, so we need to kind of like adopt different, a little bit of a different strategy, and that will come through those criticism, you know, through that constructive criticism and through the support of a future development. Remember, that day is all about future development and the support we can acquire. So that being said, first of all, we need to show that we ask and we are ready for more and we require more so we can uh, sprue our emotional fulfillment either into our career or either into our relationship. And in the same time, we need to show that we are ready to make a contact, to not be shy, and in the same time that we are not talking empty words by uh, representing our the entirety of our plan, but only we need to present those things which can materialize, exclude, excuse me, in this very moment. And now by looking at these cards, in case that is a, a full relationship and you are just, you know, boyfriend and a girlfriend status with your other half, maybe start to start talking about engagement you know not not um, offering an engagement you know not proposing but just talking about it just so you can see how the other one is gonna uh, is gonna take it what will be the reaction so you can adapt and adopt different strategy to approach the situation so eventually you can get engaged and the last card it is the result of all that in a long term, a positive one, and there could be no no better positive card in that particular case as the Magician card, which points <clears throat> that moving on forward into the future you will obtain sovereignty, you will, uh, you will also obtain iron will as far as... Um, as far as one can obtain iron will, which uh, I will try to translate it, it does mean that uh, less and less things regarding that particular tasks you, task you're trying to push on forward will actually bother you. That being said, you will be able to obtain huge control upon your situation. So the more you move into the future regarding that situation, the more control you get upon it. Also, uh, you will be recognized as one master. And that is very important because if we're talking about relationships here the one master is like exactly as one is and uh, that being said um, <clears throat> the only strategy I see you have to adopt in that particular case is just being yourself and whoever likes you likes you whoever doesn't doesn't but uh, the appearance of the magician points that the one who will like for what you are will come and you you can be sure of it. Nonetheless, the magician points that you will be able to initiate that particular project you are making or you should start making preparations here at the start of that day and the initiation will be pure which means that there will be no issues whatsoever with it so uh, in other words it's going to be a hundred percent productive and uh, you will have every mean every means necessary in order to push and finalize that particular direction so with that being said guys this was your week uh weekly the uh, daily tarot reading for the collective uh, June 12th, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.